Genesis chapter 37 verse 20. Come now therefore and let us slay him and cast him into some pit and we will say some evil beasts at devoured him. Mark that word. Some evil beasts at devoured him. And we shall see what will become of his dreams. Close your eyes. Shout this prayer point loud and clear. Say, I destroy any evil dedication made by any animals against me. In the name of Jesus, I destroy any evil dedications made by any animals against me. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You're welcome to Evangelist Joshua TV, a TV station that will teach you how to interpret your dreams with warfare prayers. Today's topic is so strange. Today's topic will be, by the grace of God, will be high opening. What is the topic of today? Today's topic is 10 animals that witches use for transport at night. 10 animals that witches use for transport at night. Do you normally see animals attacking you in the dream? Or attacking you in real life? Are you wondering why animals are biting you in the dream? Is there a time you dream of a certain animal stink, stinks you and you have a bad day? Have you ever asked yourself why some animals are used for witchcraft? Have you ever been hurt by these animals in the dream? If yes is your answer, then you are likely to be attacked by these witchcraft animals. Praise the living Jesus. I pray by the grace of God, the Lord will reveal to us the 10 animals that the witches use most often, commonly, to use for transport at night. This is very, very high opening. There are some common night animals which is used to transport themselves from their coven into the habitation of their victims. These witchcraft spirits use some animals to hold meetings in their coven. They have leaders they have members. They have messengers. These natural animals have specific demonic assignment. They often carry out against their victims. For example, if, if your enemy wants to fight, kill, and steal from a person, Instead of that enemy to come to you and challenge you one to one, they will use some, some of these night animals to send arrow into every area of your life. Evil spirits will prefer to live inside, inside of a person to dominate his or her life directly. If they feel this is not possible or their, their involvement or their stay in your life is not safe. They use animal to enter into your, into your life to make their operation successful and very easy. If you normally see these animals, we are about to share these 10 animals, any of these 10 animals, you need to pray very, very well. If you see bird crying, you have to pray. If you see snake crawling your path, you have to pray. If you see all this demonic bird that is carrying you, you have to pray. 
Now, if you believe witchcraft is real, you have to pray very well. Then what the animal, the witchcraft animal and their symbolic meaning, the witchcraft animals and their symbolic meaning, otherwise, the ten animals that which is used for transport at night, there are ten. Number one, we have the bat. Two, we have the cat. Three, we have the rat. Four, we have the war gecko. Five, we have the hole. Six, we have the crow. Seven, we have the scorpions. Eight, we have the cockroaches. Nine, we have the frogs. Ten, we have the snakes. The many, their symbolic many, and their agenda against the children of God. The bats. The bats represent spiritual blindness. The bats represent death and hell. The bat represent the symbol of prayerlessness. Bats are blind birds. They only see at night. The enemy does not want you to see good things in your life. That is why you are seeing that bats. These bats, which come as a form of witchcraft, they want to destroy the root of your virtues. If you are seeing bats in the dream, it means that the enemy wants to quench the light of your salvation. That bat will, will make you not to see the good, the goodness of God in that man. God has provided a man for you to marry. You did not see him. You are instead you, you went ahead to go and marry another man. Perhaps you are eating and dining with your enemies. This is you are saying this is the right man. And whereas this bat, they have blinded your eyes. You did not see that this person is a bad person for your marriage. Then number two, which is the cat with their symbolic meaning. The cat represents the symbol of witchcraft. The bat, the, the, the cat represents bad news. The cat represents bewitchment. Cats pass a message, the witches and the wizard. They carry out a message of death, a message of sickness, a message of business loss into the life of their victims. And whenever you are seeing cats, it is either their operation is to destroy you, it is either their, their purpose is to cause bad news in your life. What are the things you are afraid of? You are feeling that bad news is coming. Use the blood of Jesus Christ to scatter every network of witchcraft in your life. Number three, animals and their symbolic meaning is rats. Rats. Rat has symbolic meaning. The meaning of rat is poverty. Represent the symbol of poverty, the symbol of wastage, the symbol of joblessness, the symbol of betrayal, the symbol of jealousy. When you are seeing rats, rats, it means that these witches and wizards, they want to carry out an oppression of poverty into your life, an oppression of wasted. They want to waste your resources. They want to reduce your life. They want, they want that honor, that power, that fame to be sucked, to be taken away from you. When you are seeing rats in the dream, it means the spirit of joblessness, Somebody is trying to betray you. That means that the spirit of jealousy, maybe you as a person, you are, in, you are jealous of somebody. This rat you are seeing, they are jealousy, which is the witchcraft. They are jealous of you. So it's attracting this enemy of progress. When we are talking about rats, rat is a domestic animal. A rat lives with human beings, which means spiritually, the enemy used this rat as a medium of transportation to enter into your life, to enter into your home, to come and invade and scatter what God has prepared for you. Then number four is war gecko. What is the symbolic meaning of war gecko? Then it represents a symbol of monitoring spirit. When you are seeing war gecko, then the enemy, the winches, they have used war gecko to they have they have used that war gecko to transport into your life to do what majorly 
to monitor you, majorly to make you to lose that important things, majorly is for us old enemy. When you are seeing war gecko, it means that attack is coming from the household enemy. When you are seeing war gecko, if you are a man or woman, it means that you are under satanic surveillance. It means that somebody is monitoring you. You may not know, you may not have the idea of that person monitoring you, but if you know, the Bible says if you do not rescue the good flesh and blood, but you need to pray that whoever that is taking time, sitting down on a chair to monitor you, that God will frustrate them in the name of Jesus Christ. Then number five animals that which is used to transport at night is whole. You don't need anybody to tell you the spiritual meaning of whole. Praise the living Jesus. Whole. They are the birds of the night. They are the natural animals, but unclean in the Bible. When you are seen whole in the dream, you need to pray against death. When you are seen whole in the dream, you need to pray against sickness. When you are seen whole in the dream, you need to pray against evil cause. Evil cause. We are seen whole in the dream. It means that somebody is calling you for evil. When you are seen whole in the dream, you need to pray against the spirit of destruction. When you are seen whole in the dream, you need to pray against the spirit of false knowledge and evil wisdom. False knowledge and evil wisdom. That is the symbolic meaning of whole. And this all is one of the animals the enemy frequently use spiritually to deal and to disgrace and to destroy so many people. I pray for you. Every power of darkness that want to kill you at all costs, today they will die in your place in the name of Jesus Christ. Then number six animals. Number six animals that which is used to transport at night is crow. Crow. Crow are associated with magic and power to manipulate. So when you are seeing crowd, they want to carry out the message of death against you. When you are seeing crowd, they want to pass out the message of bad news, a message of evil friends. Now, do you have some friends you are keeping? The, the spiritual meaning of crowd is telling you that you need to be aware of some certain people you are moving with and you need to pray against death. That is the agenda of the enemy. Then number seven is scorpions. When you are seeing scorpion in the dream, it represents the spirit of temptation, it represents the spirit of ignorance, it represents the spirit of pains, it represents the spirit of affliction. These are the agenda of the enemies against you. So if you are wise, you are, if you are a wise Christian, you need to start praying against temptation, against pains and affliction, against ignorance. Then number eight animals that the enemy use for transport at night is cockroaches. We all know that cockroaches are incense that lives with man. When you are seeing cockroach in dream, the enemy often use them against the children of God. Their symbolical meaning represents the spirit of insanity, poverty. When you see cockroaches, they have that odor they emit out, and that they can pollute, can cause fitness as a child of God. It will make you to backslide. So when you are seeing cockroaches, can also represent fitness, unpleasant relationship and marriage. Then when the number nine animals that the enemy use for frequently for transport at night is frog. The sp sp symbolic meaning of frog represents that hypocritical behavior. Are you a Christian that you are having that hypocritical behavior? That is the spirit of the frog. The spirit of the frog can also represent a symbol of false friends. If you are keeping friends or you yourself, you are not a genuine person, the spirit of the frog is telling you for you to avoid those kind of spirit. Then the spirit of the frog represents fruitless journey. The enemy wants you to have the fruitless journey. It represents jumping at a conclusion before thinking. When you are seeing that frog, they want you to jump at the conclusion without reasoning, without wisdom, without asking for your asking for the advice of the elders. So when you are doing something like that, you are planning to fail. It can also represent cause and it can also represent the activity of witchcraft. Lastly, the 10 animals which the enemy use for transport at night, whenever you see them, even in the waking life, it is snake. When the Bible says that he has given you power to train upon serpent and scorpion, there is a purpose. When snake appeared in that garden of Eden, there was a purpose. So when you are seeing snake, automatically they want to carry out some several purposes. Number one, deceptions and lies. Number two, somebody wants to lie against you. 
deceptive spirit. It indicates threats. It indicates obstacles. It indicates demonic influence. It indicates troubles, hatred, danger, and treachery. I pray for you. Any, 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 any power that want to carry out that spirit of deception, that spirit of threat and obstruction to your life, to your marriage, they shall be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Close your eyes. Shout this prayer point loud and clear. Say, all agents of evil diversion against my life and destiny, scatter by fire, scatter by fire. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, any witchcraft meeting assigned against me in the head, in the land, or in the sea, scatter in the name of Jesus. Scatter in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Say, every witchcraft agent sent to monitor my progress in my house and in the office, receive blindness in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. If you are taking that prayer point, congratulations. The Lord will help you. The Lord will use. The Lord will come in. The Lord will intervene in your situation and deal with those witchcraft animals that is attacking your virtue, the source of your glory in Jesus' name. If you have any animals that is attacking you, do not hesitate to write them at the comment section. Once again, this is Evangelist Joshua from Lagos. Mm -hmm.